<laughs> Fuck you all too. Yeah. <laughs> at least the warning went out first that's the important thing folks it's saturday night welcome to murder hobo inc uh, the one shot edition pleased to have you if you're coming back woo, you are a glutton for punishment but we're glad to have you here uh follow us on twitch follow us on twitter take a look at our youtube archive if you want to shoot the shit with us about D, join our discord if you want to buy our cool fine quality crap <laughs> uh anything from a shower curtain on down shirts uh i don't know there there might be a line of toiletries coming we aren't really sure we don't know uh check out our shop uh uh, most importantly if you want to be on one of the one shots still have a couple left in january and then we'll have one every other week in february m hobo inc twitter or gmail Hit us up there. We'll get you in here, uh, just like our new player, Rob. Uh, thanks to our sponsors, Pirate Dog Dice. I think tonight I'll use uh, Old Red on these guys because they're first level. Uh, and, of course, uh, oddfishgames.com. Oddfishgames.com. If the game stinks, try Adventure Sense. Do not deeply inhale them like Kyle did because he's an idiot. Uh, don't do that. Don't do that. And if you're interested in learning how to write, check out their shine system. That's oddfishgames.com. Okay. Uh, first level. Uh, these guys are so dead. Uh, let's introduce you to our players. We got three long timers and one brand new player. Uh, we will start off with the lady of the house. Ernie, tell us who you are. <laughs> hey. knew it. I knew it. I totally knew you were going to go there. <laughs> So uh, I'm Ernest, and I'm playing Russell, the uh, halfling fighter tonight. And one thing about Russell, if you've watched uh, any of my one shots before, is he hates tall people. He's a three foot one tall person hater. So this will be fun. Uh, next up is Carol. Carol, go ahead. <laughs> well, he's not going to hate me because I'm playing tonight. Luna Hades. I my... hate it already. <laughs> Shut up. My grave, my goth gnome grave cleric, dressed all in black and believes that life is futile. Da da da. Uh, hi, I'm, uh, my name is Carol. I am a longtime gamer, occasional GM, and a commission mini painter. And I was recently in the campaign, and we'll see. I'll, I'll be in the next one. <laughs> that is true. Next up, uh, Scott. Scott, <laughs> tell us who you are. Tell us who you're playing tonight. You're muted. Come on, Frank. Hi, I'm Scott. I'm, uh, I'm uh, <laughs> muted. And uh, no, I'm, I'm not anymore. I'm um, um, most, most of the time DM. I've DM'd on, on Murder Hub Link a few times as well. But... I've played in several one shots. Uh, tonight, I'll be playing a, a human uh, muck um, who uh, who is who is Shaft, and Shaft is is a very calm, calm person. I'm not paying playing him as the um, you know the <laughs> exactly the um, <clears throat> Shaft that we all know and love, Samuel Jackson, or the uh, other version. No, this is a very calm and tranquil man. He sure. is the shaft on the way of the shaft. What? Oh, uh, sure he Try is. To startle you a little this bit. is Murder Hobo Inc. Calm and yeah, sure. You're going to be David calm. Carradine in the closet with the rope tonight. Yes. <laughs> the, he Shaft is also very tall. He's about <laughs> six foot three. He, he is tall, very thin, and very dedicated to his physical appearance. That is the way of the shaft. The shaft is the shaft. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, is this supposed to be a stick or something? Oh, no. I'm, I'm not getting the reference then. The Sorry. way is the way. The way is the way of the shaft. I think uh, Big Lebowski, <laughs> I think, is what he's going to go for. Last but certainly not least, uh, he's still here, even though he's listened to these three assholes talk already. <laughs> Rob, Rob, uh, welcome to Murder Hobo Week. Tell us about yourself. Tell us about your character, please. I'm a forever DM escaping that life, I hope. My name's Rob, uh, and I'm going to be playing Marimo Mosspants, uh, who is a halfling ranger. Most useless class, I'm told, in D&D 5e, and I'm going to see if I can make him useful. Um, I don't buy that, by the way. I oh, no, do I. They're, nor they're do I. You don't think Rob can make him useful? No, no I think they are useful. I don't. I mean, they're more uh, useful that's the only than part I'm questioning. fighters, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> 
<laughs> they're fighters that can use spells. So how about that? <laughs> Aren't fighters used to absorb damage from monsters? Yes. Oh, that's old one and two e crap. That's yeah, Scott. no. Not with my thirteen. <laughs> last points. time I played five e, that's exactly what happened. <laughs> oh, you're in. You're in for a rude shock. <laughs> yeah, that's what shaft is for. That's true. Shaft is what shaft is for. Folks, shaft is what uh, shaft is for. Good. Four first level, all maximum hit points, no magic items. Uh, they are eager to start their adventuring career, and the mayor of Noblesville has given them a delivery message job, uh, paying them 200 gold total, 50 gold pieces each. Uh, not too bad for first level people. They are supposed to follow the road down to uh, Wenton Springs. It is a coastal thorpe. Unfortunately, a, uh, shall we say, large storm slash hurricane has hit the region pretty bad, hence the uh, sealed letter from the mayor of Noblesville. Uh, the trail is going to take them through something called Beholder Swamp, just an ominous name, probably not the home to a beholder at first level, so they're probably okay. No eye tyrants, most likely, probably no gas spores, possibly. Uh, hard to say what they're going to find. You uh, four go. It's about a day's walk. <coughs> I'm, I'm not going to give you our tax, despite what Twitter had. Maybe find our tax in the swamp. Uh, after about a day of travel, uh, you're starting to see a little bit of damage in the foliage and the uh, fo the flora. Uh, really? That starting out early, are we? <laughs> what? <coughs> we can hear you. <laughs> Sorry, no, I'm just trying to fix something. So okay. Uh, after about a day, uh, you guys see a post at the crossroads pointing you to Winton Springs. Uh, the other way is listed as uh, I will kill you if you go down this road trail, Ernie. Uh, <laughs> sounds good. Uh, a large I have a question. Yes. Uh, is I will kill you if you go down this way, possibly a shortcut? No, it goes the exact opposite direction. That doesn't mean it's not a shortcut. No, that's I think true. It, it, I, it, think it, I think what it means is that if we go that way, we send his carefully planned scenario off the rails, and he'll just murder us. Well, my and question we'll, is, are we in the swamp yet? Uh, you are not. It is just ahead. Ah, uh, good. About to get to my home. Yes. I, I figured the ranger would have preferred terrain as the swamp. And, <laughs> and undead is my favorite enemy, just in case. But that's for my backstory. No, that works. Uh, as you reach the crossroads, uh, you hear a, not Russell, Russell uh, in a clump of bushes nearby. Everybody give me perception checks. Perception check. Hang on. Blech. What is my perception? Shaft rolls an eight. Eleven. 19. Seven. Shaft is not happy. With uh, Russell, Shaft, and Luna all looking the wrong way, the diminutive uh, moss pants uh, notices the top of what appears to be a head centered in the clump of bushes. I believe uh, I have an arrow on the string. Okay. Do you want to fire into it? Oh, no. I'll just say, what's your business then? Uh, a human being stands up out of the clump, rips off a handful of leaves, and reaches around behind him. My business is none of your business. However, maybe I can help you out. My name is Harry Shute, purveyor of magical items and magical elixirs. Uh, the man comes out. He's left his front open. The horse is not out. However, it is clear that it is attempting to escape. The man appears as though he was just taking a constitutional in the bushes. He is of normal height, about 5'10", a little bit uh, heavy set, and dressed in merchant clothes. He reaches behind the clump of bushes where a big backpack sits, drags it up, comes up and reaches out with the same hand that he had pulled all of the leaves out. He will start with da, 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 da. number four. Uh, he starts out with Shaft. Shaft says Shaft does not want to take the hand of this defiling creature who has defiled his body. 
Shaft must back away. This is not the way. I'm drifting sideways 10 feet. Nice. Uh -oh. That's that, that's just my microphone picking it up. <laughs> oh, is it you? Yeah, it's me because the TV's in the other room. Uh, okay. I'll go ahead and move it. Sorry, over folks. Bit. No, you're fine. <laughs> uh, the next one he goes to is Luna. He extends his hand. Mm, let's see. What have I got for spells here? Do I have? I don't think I have that. <clears throat> uh, no, I don't have that. I mean, like. Fine. I'll do it. I'll shake his hand. It's uh, the one he said he was using to rub his ass with. Yes. Uh, D12. And then I'm going to friggin' wipe it off on, my, on the ground. Uh, oh, well, you're going to beat me. That's a two. Yeah, his hand was wet. <laughs> <laughs> well, Please, pleased wet. to meet you, my dear. Pats you on the back and no, 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 no. I step back. <laughs> I, I'll shake his hand and I step back so you can't do that. Uh, and I wipe my hand. Russell, I think you're the uh, only one left because uh, Moss Pants stepped back. Uh, he extends his hand to you. Hello, what sir. What race is he? He is a human. Tall He's tall. Yeah, yeah. I, I stick my, my sword out at him. I'm like, get back, <clears throat> fucking giraffe. Go with your kind over there. <laughs> Russell the racist. <laughs> uh, he puts his hands up and he goes, I meant no offense. I was just merely offering my unique services to the adventuring ilk that I see before me. Certainly brave heroes as yourself are in need of surplus magic that might come in useful if you're headed into those nasty fens. Do we look like we have money? <laughs> We're all level one here. <laughs> <laughs> so you're telling me that there is an economic issue. I do have some, shall we say, uh, cut rate items that I would be happy to sell you. Uh, it smells like he eats cut rate as well. <laughs> Good, maybe. But his backpack is full. Where are you going? Where are you going? <clears throat> I'm going to Noblesville. Uh, That's where you guys came and from. And you're, 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 he's going the way we came? Mm -hmm. Well, we're not going that way. That's where we came from. So yeah, I don't watch out for that plague. I'm unfamiliar with any plague there. However, oh, yeah, there's a plague spreading. I have an elixir <laughs> right here in my backpack that will come in handy. Oh, well, you might get some good business in Noblesville <clears throat> then. Just try not to die. So I take it none of you are interested in <laughs> purchasing cut rate magic. Mm, I don't really have much to give you. Shaft's body beg. is this temple. <laughs> Shaft does not need any elixirs, nor does Shaft need any magic. Shaft has the way. Uh, he looks at Moss Pants. Uh, you, my diminutive friend with the arrow pointed at my groin, what can, uh, what can I, the humble Harry Shoot, offer you? Hmm. Offer me what? You've got magic and such in your baggie there then? I do indeed, sir. I have some of the finest magic, but if you're shy on coin, I can offer you some cut rate magic. <laughs> Really? Have you got like some, you know, magic band aids or one of them potions of healing, like for that? And do you I have magical jerky. Now? Magical jerky. Magical jerky. The finest magical jerky in the land. I can give you a pull off that for an easy 20 gold pieces. I think you should keep your jerky there, fancy boy. As you wish. You may need it. You may rue the day of you entering Beholder Swamp without my magical jerky, my small yet attractive friend. How about if I sweeten the pot and offer it to you for 10 gold pieces? Would that be of interest? What does you it do? You know, you're do? starting to talk my language like... 
what does it I, it, it heals you when you're ill. Okay. Ill or damaged? That's a different thing altogether. It heals any damage that you take. My okay. dear, I do not seek to damage anyone. I am but a purveyor of secondhand, second-rate magic. Magic well, on the boy, cheap. Prove that it can heal. And I, I poke him a little bit with my sword. Just enough to draw a little bit of blood. <laughs> Where do you poke him at? Just his arm. Just poke him a little bit. I see. You're those kinds of people. He can I roll in. intimidation? You can, but you aren't going to beat that roll. <laughs> oh. Well, we'll see. Nat 20. Uh, what's my modifier for intimidation? I got a 19, so the, the nat 20 will beat me. He is, he is concerned. Okay. Uh, he's a little bit concerned, but he reaches into his backpack, pulls out a long Slim Jim. And you see the cut magically close. I am for that then. Ta-da! Cool. Oh. I don't want any. Thanks. <laughs> I'll tear yes, my, um, my clothing and um, put ten gold pieces in it and toss it to him. Okay. He gives you uh, a length of about six inches. Uh, tells you there's two bites there. Uh, don't swallow it. It's very important that you do not swallow it. Uh, chew it for a short period of time and then spit it out. Do not swallow it. What happens if you swallow it? I, I, I can. It turns into a short horse's ass like yourself. <laughs> mm. We've got one of those already then. Yes. Do not swallow. Do not swallow. I can imagine Russell's thinking, what's the drawback here? <laughs> well, I will be on my way. Good luck in crossing Beholder Swamp. You know what? Short one. I'm glad you cut me. I'm going to give you something special because oh, no. you you helped me make a sale. He reaches in and gives you a little lead pin in the shape of a mosquito. My compliments to you on helping me make the sale, my friend. Where what does it cry? Thank what, you. What does it do? Or is it, it is, just a pin? It is jewelry. Ah, it's treasure. A little lead mosquito. Thank you. Do not eat it. <laughs> uh, he hikes up his backpack and heads off towards Noblesville, whistling a jaunty tune. Does it seem to you that fellow has something against eating things? I think something is wrong with that guy, no matter what. I don't know what it is. Says All the guy people. who stabbed him. <laughs> I, he was looming over us. I wanted product testing too. I was thinking of shooting him with an arrow. The stab was probably go. nicer. Yeah, that was way nicer. Uh, the trail leads into uh, some mossy overgrown magnolias uh, and it smells of moisture ahead. Moisture. Ah. So it smells like mm. swamp, right? It smells mm. like home. Like swamp. Moss yeah. pants will be at home in this location. Now we need a couple forms. of crocodiles and things <clears throat> so beautiful. Shaft informs the rest of the group, have no fear, Shaft is here. Shaft is excited about walking down this path. Shaft is convinced that this is the way. And he leads just walking confidently in the surety of his path. All right, you two stay with me. I can't get lost. I don't know where he's going. <laughs> uh, I that's fine. I I hang out with uh, my short friends. I tell I, you stay. I take the advice of uh, <coughs> Moss Pants. Actually, uh, I was going to say I stay at the back anyway, so that's not really a big deal. It's easy for me. I'll I'll, take I'll trust that you know where you're going. Uh, have I seen a map that shows me where this um, village 
is that we're going to here, the Seaside Village? No, you have not. You just know that it's on the coastline. And I forgot I was using the game overlay, so I can't even show you uh, the player's map. Uh, well, That's there's fine. a player's map, though. I've seen some kind of map. Uh, no, I haven't published this one yet, so you haven't okay. seen shit. <laughs> uh, as uh, Shaft uh, prominently strides into the magnolia bush. Uh, following you Shaft follows his gut. Shaft is all about following the way. Hey, Shaft, how do you know you're going the right way? Shaft knows. Shaft follows the way. How do you know? How do you know? Shaft knows. The I'm Shaft knows the Shaft. Way. Have you ever been here? Then I'm not trusting that you know. I'll trust that the, I'll trust that the guy who's good at this sort of thing. Shaft understands your concern. <laughs> what I guys stop shouting. One of you's in the front. One of you's in the back. This is give me a headache. No, 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 no. That's right. So I keep shouting. <laughs> I'm just gonna go the towards Shaft. Wenton Springs. I I'm following uh, Moss Pants. Oh yeah, I totally follow Moss Pants. Uh, Shaft, give Let's me a split up the party. roll. Let's split up the party in a one shot. Nine. <clears throat> uh, Shaft, you want to go a little bit more to the right than Moss Pants does. Moss Pants seems to be following an indiscernible trail to your human eyes, uh, but it's relatively close to the direction that you are feeling <laughs> deep within your soul. Would you like to let him lead or do you want to continue to lead? I'm going to continue to follow my heart. Okay. Okay. So there will now, be a slight divergence. Now, Shaft <laughs> is concerned if the party splits more than, you know, 30 or 40 feet. But Shaft feels he must feel his feel. That's fine. Shaft can do what he wants. Shaft is a monk. Shaft knows shit. Yeah. Uh, if you Just check your email. out for the bushes with the red splotches. Yeah. If, you guys, if you guys check your email, you will have a player map. Uh, as you guys diverge slightly, you notice that uh, some greenish, brackish water separates you. Uh, the water goes in both directions uh, because it's a swamp. There is a slight jump uh, to firmer ground. Uh, which appears to go off to the left and off to the right as well. But first, you must deal with this waterway. Uh, Moss Pants, uh, we'll start with uh, your trifecta. How would you like to uh, ford this gap in brackish green water? Also, wow. there's a lot of bullfrogs here. Yeah, I'm going to poke my staff around a bit and scan and make sure there aren't any crocodiles immediately around. D12 against me. All right. Which one should I use? Oh, yeah, the swamp colored one. That is a 12. Uh, you hit something, but since this is your preferred terrain, uh, that's a log. So you do not feel that there are any hidden crocodiles in this area. Plus, the gap is not very vast. It is almost non existent for shaft. However, you three short people. I've got a staff, and I'll use it to place it on the log and kind of just vault my way across. I will take dexterity or acrobatics check, please. Okay. I'll roll it with dex because I don't have acrobatics, only athletics. But my dex is 19, so... Is there room for more uh, than one on that log? Well, he's using his staff. That's, that's a 15. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Uh, he vaults over and successfully boards the gap. Uh, Shaft, you see this and think, I can almost leap that on my uh, sleeping. Uh, Shaft will go with you. Do you want to go into the brackish water, wade in like your King Arthur receiving Excalibur, or do you want to try and ford the gap at the narrow part? Yeah, well, there's frogs, there's leeches, you know. Shaft has no fear of leeches. Shaft wades into the water and lets nature surround him. Beautiful. Filling his. I try to leapfrog him as he crosses. 
<laughs> well, he, I, he, he is over here. You're following. Oh, us, never mind. Sorry. Too bad. I thought it was the same bit of water. I was going to use him as a uh, springboard. Chef, I chef. was going to just go onto his shoulders and, you know, let chef him wait across kind of, the other. Shaft does kind of start moving towards the other group because while Shaft feels that he's always right, he also understands that sometimes Shaft misjudges where the way is. And perhaps other people's understanding of the way is what Shaft should be understanding of the way. So the way may not exactly be what the Shaft thinks the Shaft is. So, so what I'm hearing shaft, is Shaft is sheeple. Shaft is going to get shafted is what I'm hearing. <laughs> uh, shaft, roll a straight up D20 for me, please. Okay. Uh, that's a nine. Okay. Uh, you cross through the water, letting the abundance of knowledge protect you, wade up into the soft grasses where moss pants is. Uh, Russell and Luna, how do you want to ford this? Uh, you, I, if you have a staff, you can try the same move that moss pants did, or you can just do a running jump. I'll try a running jump. Oh, God, yeah. this is going to go bad. I'm a remarkable athlete. Uh-huh. Uh, what's DC? How about you roll? <laughs> All right. Uh, acrobatics? Uh, if you want, or dexterity. Uh, same for me. Um, well, <laughs> luckily, I'm lucky as a halfling. Um, let's see, what's this? Lucky. <laughs> Halflings can reroll a natural roll one, one on any attack, <laughs> ability, ability, or save. Yeah, you All can right. do this. Yeah, so you can reroll. Reroll. Halfling Ooh. pride. <laughs> Twelve. Uh, uh, as you leap onto where you're pretty no. sure the log was, you feel your weight distribute improperly, but you still manage to jump onto the soggy ground. Uh, Ta-da! Luckily, I'm lucky. <laughs> uh, Luna, you're on the beautiful, other man. side. That was beautiful. Wait, how far? Hey, hey, Shaft, come back here. Give me a lift. Shaft is here. Shaft? Does, does, do you need the shaft? <laughs> if the shaft no, she just needs a ride. In some okay. time. <laughs> yes, I need the, to ride the shaft. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, we've got jerky. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> you know that was that door was wide open. Right. Folks. Man, that's I 28 minutes that. into it. <laughs> <laughs> no, shaft, shaft is happy to help. If 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 you need to ride the shaft, the shaft is here to be ridden. So you kind of armor are you wearing I, shaft? Are you coming to that? Nothing. I, I don't He's think a monk. Nothing. It's a mug, monk. man. You don't need armor. Armor's <laughs> for chumps like me. All right, so did you come back over and give me a walk over? Absolutely. Absolutely. Just don't trip when I'm on your shoulders. That's all I ask. Oh, yeah. What armor are you wearing? Just uh, me? I'm just wondering how much me? people think. <laughs> uh, Luna, give me a perception check, please. Okay, give me a sec. Do you know what I'm wearing? No. Yeah. Just, You're the just only one I'm worried about check. sinking in this swamp. Well, I'm going to ride on your shoulders. So. And Shaft, give me a D4, please. You said yep. a perception check? Yep. Uh, that would be where those. Uh, that's a. Uh, oh, that's twenty one. You you notice that Shaft has uh, two parasites on him in the form of leeches. Oh God! No, come up here. Come out of the water for a minute, and I'll pick him off. Is that a when he gets over here? Oh, I'll help pull one off too. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how they're supposed to be removed. But, a birdie. Uh, Use a torch. Just burn I, it right off. We're, it's too wet. I can't. Hey, don't even need a torch. Right Just a little spark will do it. Uh, Shaft, you have been uh, relieved of two small leeches that do absolutely no damage to you at this time. Uh, you carry Luna over to the soft earth uh, where the other two are at, waiting, I'll say, patiently because. I'm not sure what they're doing. Uh, a loud buzzing is heard through the mossy trees that are located on this soft 
Earth. Uh, you are having trouble getting a bearing on it. Moments later, the source of noise er, becomes obvious as a giant wasp is headed right for you. Russell, oh, Russell, your little ornament is heating up. Oh, my mosquito? Yep. Uh, everybody roll initiative. Oh, Ooh. interesting. Ooh. That was terrible initiative. That's a 20. 23. Nine. And good. I, it's perfect. I'm going at a five. Wow. Uh, yeah. Lost pants. You see it first. It's making a strafing or a strafing run on a beeline right for you. <laughs> you, number one. Oh, just at me then. Just at you. I'll put an arrow right down it. Okay. Uh, that's an 18 plus that uh, 6 is 24. So that's a D6 plus 4. That's uh, 8. 8 hit points. Uh, when Shaft gets back, it will be his turn. All right. <clears throat> so is this a wasp, you said? Giant <coughs> wasp. And a Giant second wasp. one is coming in behind it. Okay, cool. Uh, and it's going to go after to Russell. Cool. Did um I think Shaft is going after some Don Julio. Don Julio, not our sponsor, but certainly a friend of the podcast. For beverages that burn out your throat, including COVID-19, try Don Julio. What? What? Hey, they aren't paying me to be nice to them. <laughs> yeah, uh, Shaft, I know. you're up and there's a second uh, wasp coming in behind the first. Shaft is not afraid of these wasps. Shaft is a matter of fact. Shaft is going to try to intimidate these wasps by posing and meditating and thinking really strong, positive thoughts. That might work. Sure. Not with a nat 20, it's not. <laughs> uh, the good news is the nat 20 was on your intimidation check. The bad news is now I'm going after Moss Pants and Russell on Moss Pants. <laughs> Two plus four is six. I don't think that's going to get you. On I'm Russell. used to these kind of things. Uh, Ten plus four, Russell. Nope. Two swings and a miss. Uh, next up is the nine. Russell, uh, you've got one on you. There's also one on Moss Pants. Yeah, I'm going to swing my uh, sword at the one on me. Uh, let's see, plus six to hit. So 18 to hit. Uh, easy, easily. Cool. And what is this? 1d8 plus 4. Where are we at? And that is a 6, 10. 10 damage. Ouch. Uh, <laughs> Luna, both are severely injured. Which one would you like to go after? Uh, oh, let's see. Uh, eeny, meeny, miny, I don't care. I'll go on the one of Russell. Okay. Uh, I guess, and I'm gonna do since it's already been injured, right? Uh, make a wisdom saving throw, please. Seven plus not much, I'm sure. Minus one, six. Bong! As I cast Toll the Dead. And Aha. what was that other? What is the other damage for this? It's a D, what, 12? D10. <laughs> It's a D8, but if you're a D8, if the hurt, oh, is missing any hit points, it takes one D12. <coughs> yeah, I love this spell, especially at low levels. You're going to take eight points of damage. It careens into the soft surface and skids to a stop right at your feet. Uh, top of the order, uh, Moss Pants, uh, the one on you looks mean, angry, and severely injured. And suddenly it's going to sprout a short sword through its neck. <laughs> maybe. Maybe the short sword goes into the muck. <laughs> no, I don't know. It's a finesse weapon. That's, when I roll so that's a 17, 18, 19. You have successfully skewered it. And that's another uh, D6, right? Yeah, Yeah, because it had one hit point. Oh, well, it's <laughs> dead then. Very nice. Uh, everybody give me D20 rolls, please. Arcana. Or can't I don't know Arcana? I assume 16. you need to know it, right? 
18. No, 11. Uh, if it's just uh, Arcana. Straight um, up Arcana. Uh, that would be Intelligence. 17 then because I'm not that smart. Yeah, and I have 18. Luna, what'd you get? Oh, that they, they all beat me. So oh, I got 11. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, you beat me. That. What was yours, Moss Pants? 10. Oh, uh, I tip Pete somebody. <laughs> Russell and Shaft. Uh, those wings might be valuable to somebody if you can cut them off correctly. Oh, can't can't desecrate his. Uh, Here comes Russell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go Chef and stop on the bodies of them. Know. Fuck those things. <laughs> Fair enough. You destroy what little money that you could so have had. Is my thing still getting warm? My little nope. pin? Cold as ice. Oh, so it only gets warm when damage approaches. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. my insight. I'm gonna roll a, a check to see if I figure that out. My character does. Sure, go ahead. I'm gonna uh, forge some rations off those giant wasps. Okay. Uh, 19 minus 2. 17 on Insight. So yeah, you don't think that's what it is. <laughs> I don't? Oh, okay. Cool. <laughs> you think it's more of a beacon, maybe. Because you didn't like that tall guy. Just like crab. Got it. It's a beacon, so all the enemies will be coming towards me. Only ones with wings. Oh. Q Hippogriff. <laughs> uh, that's interesting. Okay, Moss Pants, uh, you could go left, which you deem as probably back out of the swamp, or right, putting you deeper into the swamp shaft. Uh, you also notice the same thing. Yeah. Shaft is going to follow the ranger, because now Shaft realizes <laughs> that that's the way. The way is to follow the person <clears throat> to know the way. Fair enough. Moss Pants, what do you think? <clears throat> You can also hear bubbling and gurgling ahead. Well, you know, the best way to take people that aren't from swamps through swamps is on the edges, but um, I think we should continue deeper into the swamp. Yeah. So, the most direct route to the coast. Yeah. Okay. So, you're going to hang around. So, that I follow uh, you at the back of the pack. Again. Uh, whoo. Uh, more buzzing is heard, uh, and it appears to be coming from in front of you as three more giant wasps appear. They seem to be keying up on Shaft, Shaft, and Moss Pants. I've got everybody, an arrow for that. <laughs> everybody roll initiative again. Oh, man, there's a lot of these things. I rolled... One uh, better than last time. I only got a 19. 21. I only got a 19 this time. Seven. Russell. That's too higher. 23. Ooh. Uh, to go. Russell, wow. you're up first. Cool. Gonna I'm going to go up them. and help out Moss Pants. <laughs> and that was an 18 to hit. Yep. Uh, where's my D8? <clears throat> two, 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 nine damage. Nicely done. Uh, next up is the 21. Shaft. Shaft, give me a straight up D20 roll first, please. Okay. Uh, go ahead and attack. Shaft isn't going to attack because these are creatures and he feels an affinity. Oh, no. Shaft announces to everyone that these are brother creatures. <laughs> and Shaft feels that he should join with them and welcome them. Just, 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 just welcome them. And so I'm he smiles. Out soon. Shaft is going to smile and say, come here, brother Wasp. Come here to the shaft. Let me show you the way. Awesome. Uh, next up is the 19 uh, Moss Pants. Well, there's one that's trying to attack you. me right there with Russell, so I'll use my short sword to end it. Correct. Uh, that's a 15. <laughs> yep. Okay, where's my D6? And 5 plus 4 is 9. Good enough. Uh, that puts him down. Uh, Luda, you still rolled better than me. I rolled a 4. So. Wow! Oh my god, I, didn't, I wasn't expecting that. Um, 
I'm just... uh, apparently Shaft is welcoming him like he's Swamp Jesus. <laughs> I look at I like look at Shaft and I'm like, you know, I always said I got a weird vibe <laughs> from you with the always referring to yourself in the third person thing, but but now you're welcoming these creatures that should likely, you know, would be much better much in the next mix, much they'd be much happier in the next life rather than in this miserable old swamp swamp. And just wondering if jerky cures poison. We I doubt that. Out. Uh I don't believe they've lost any hip wait, that is are any of them damaged? No, uh, there are two left. The damaged one was on Moss Prince right, and it right. is dead. All right. I mean, it won't do as much damage if I it fails to save. So I'll do Toll the Dead again. Because I think uh, they don't have as high a wisdom as they do. Left and right. One on the left. Uh, left. Oh, no, just one. One target. So left. Oh, uh, that's a two on the roll minus <laughs> one. Yeah, I, I knew that was probably the right right one. Uh, that's it's only going to be three points of damage, though. Yeah, it's not going to do Bling. much. Well, it's damage, and they don't have a lot of hit points, so it does something. That's true. Uh, neither do you guys. Your first level shaft. Uh, they <laughs> welcome your embrace by attempting to spear you. Uh, the one that's now injured. Whew, four plus four is eight. I don't think that's going to get you. The other one. That's Natural one. <laughs> oh no! Does it sting uh, first, its partner? First person to attack the one on that side gets advantage. So back to the top of the order, Russell. Um, I keep a lookout and stop <laughs> on the uh, dead creature that we just killed, Moss Pants uh, and I. Don't crush uh, the legs. We'll need those later. Shaft. <laughs> okay. Shaft is like so delicious snow crab. That, that that these guys are just buzzing around, just being a part of nature. Shaft just is just really <laughs> into the moment right now. He assumes a lotus oh. position on the ground. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna get advantage on you doing that, right? <laughs> uh, okay, moss pants for some reason. Uh, Shaft has swamp fever already. It could have been the leeches. Maybe there's one on his uh, scrotum. that you Yeah, it can drain a lot of blood that way. He could have a yep. six-pound leech hanging down there. <laughs> That's true. Anyway, I'm going to put an arrow through that uh, bugger that God, was uninjured Lord. on him. Uh, at advantage. Oh, yeah. Let's see. We'll throw two d20s simultaneous then. Wah! Oh. oh, that's a good thing I threw that at advantage. Uh, that's a 6, which would be a 12, or a 13, which is a 19. Either one would hit. Very easy, okay. 12. Uh, it's only 5 points of damage, though. It's still alive. Uh, next up is Luna. Luna, one of your party members, is keeping watch and stomping the shit out of the dead one. One of them is in lotus position, and the guy leading you is uh, flinging arrows all over the place. Yeah, he's actually being useful. Um, so I'm going to... Don't judge. I'm going... <laughs> That's not judging. It's reality. He's the only one here being useful other than me. Um, so... I wrestle helps. <laughs> I'm going to take the one that's damaged. I'm <coughs> going to cast Toll the Dead again. So that's a DC 13 wisdom save. Uh, that's another two minus one. Oops, that's at the right die. It's not D20 damage. It's going to be dead because it does 11 points of damage. Uh, that makes it 14, and that does indeed kill it, leaving just one in the lotus position. I'm leaving. Yeah, I left the perfectly healthy one, you know. <laughs> no, I heard no, that it's one. Got, it's got five. Oh, oh, okay. Why do they want them to, to try to murder Shaft? Uh, does a 14 hit Shaft? No. A 15 is oh, my class. Damn it. Uh, Russell, <laughs> there's only one left. Are there enemies approaching? No other enemies at this time. I will keep my watch. Shaft. 
<laughs> that calls out to the other wasp. Brother wasp, come and sit down. Are you, oh, wait, wait a minute. Are you, are you Shaft Kirk? <laughs> Getting a specific vibe on Shaft right now because he is dramatic. <laughs> He is he is Hamasaurus Rex. I mean, no, he Shaft is Shaft is just no. Really I'm talking about these, Shaft is really convinced that these little waspies they're just buzzing around, minding their own business. I'm not talking they, about they, Shaft. They, they I'm talking anything. about I'm talking about you, not Shaft, Hamasaurus Rex. Yeah, wow. but you know, it's awesome. Okay, uh, boss pants, uh, <laughs> you're a party of do-gooders. <laughs> Uh, are, are quite effective. You're up. I, I'm going to uh, put it out of its misery because okay. I'm pretty sure the wasp is getting the worst end of the deal at this time. So I'm going to kill it and make it happier. Okay. It's, yeah, having to, it's having it's having to listen to Shaft, so it's probably wanting to die. Yeah, life is futile, anyways. Put it at, into the oh. next life where it's where you're there so much longer. Their AC 13 hit their AC. 13 hits their AC. Okay. Um, that's 10 points of damage. Uh, just barely enough to knock it down, yeah. laying it into Shaft's lap. <laughs> oh. <sighs> no Shaft chance that stinger's not going to go into him, huh? Uh, Moss Pants uh, and Russell, you notice that the soft ground continues forward and it extends uh, covered in droopy willows and mag uh, magnolia trees. Okay. I'll right, cruise ahead. Moss pants. I'll let you lead. Well, I can't be surprised here in things, you know, so let's go. <laughs> uh, as you get up into a small kind of hilly area rising above the swamp, you notice that you are now surrounded on three fronts, kind of three fronts. Uh, however, there's a small spit of land going towards the right, uh, a thicker span of uh, dirt to the left. Okay. Um, we'll go left, I think. Uh, you move uh, down the hill into soft, spongy ground. Uh, everybody roll initiative as yet another giant wasp ah. comes in. And focuses on Shaft. Oh my god, this is even worse. 13. Natural 17. One. I still beat you on a four. <laughs> Boss Pants, a three, 17. <clears throat> uh, Russell, did you get the 17 as well, or did I miss Yeah, we, we both got 17. Fair enough. 17s go first. A giant wasp is headed right for Shaft. Uh, I'll shoot it with an arrow. I'll keep other. watch to make sure there are no other <laughs> enemies approaching. Shaft. Honestly, honestly, Frank, why don't you just have me and Moss Pants roll initiative and forget the other two because they're just gonna take. Oh, them. I'll I'll protect <laughs> my fellow short people. That's for sure. Go ahead, Moss Pants, take your it's shot. It's a sixteen to hit and ten damage. Okay, uh, Luna. Well, hang on a second. I have to do it correctly. Yeah. Shaft, Shaft, would you like to do anything? Shaft wants to pray over all of these terrible sins being committed. Shaft all right, is, Russell, I just need one more for dinner. Just uh, go I, ahead, Luna. <laughs> Told it, rank another DC 13. Will wisdom save? Ain't, ain't going to happen. Ain't going to happen. Wow. So that's three. three. You can't. Your dice are rolling great tonight, Frank. Uh, that is a seven points of damage. That wait, did, it, wait. What? Yeah, I was missing tape. The white said yes. That is correct. That is enough to kill the giant wasp. Would you because, grab that arrow on your way up and hand it to me later, please? Oh sure. Uh, you move out, uh, Russell. You do not see any colonies. You aren't sure where all these damn giant wasps are coming from. Uh, but for whatever reason, they aren't coming after you. So that's the important thing. Uh, the soft ground continues to give little comfort as your movement is slowed. You and no, your it's not. 
Well, not for you. You and no your co. None of them. Really? That not if they're with me. Okay. Well, you've seen how they're playing. Do you really yeah, think well, they're going to take? <laughs> that's true. <I> will. <laughs> if you follow me, you'll come right along. If you lag behind, you'll stay behind. Uh, let, let me rephrase. Shaft. Uh, <laughs> the ground gives little comfort and your movement is slowed, but because you are a monk, you get to move a little bit faster. You and your cohorts realize that there are a lot of flies and mosquitoes uh, around here uh, and something smells dead. Everybody roll mm. perception. Who smells dead? Well, they're in a better place. <clears throat> That's a crap. Uh, two fours yeah well i rolled better than that i rolled a, at least i rolled like a 10 moss pants yeah, 12 total uh, oh boy moss pants something's coming up out of the water around here oh uh, all right everybody back up a bit onto drier ground skeletons Ooh, my oh, favorite four of them uh, everybody roll initiative i shall Short sword in either hand. Oh, that was good initiative this time for me. That's a 20. 22. Well, that's bad. Good for me. So it's, uh, that's a 16. And that's still slower than most of the party. I got a 7. Uh, 22. Uh, what, Shaft, were you a natural 20 or dirty 20? No, no, it was a um, uh, dirty 20. 22, Moss Pants, uh, there are skeletons coming out. Uh, you, being an undead fanatic, know that uh, edged weapons are only going to do half damage. I do indeed. I'm going to use my staff. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I will swing the hell out of my staff. And that is a... That's my strength bonus. What is that? Oh, yeah. That's an 18 to hit. 13 to hit the skeletons. So you are successful. Uh, and that's going to do four points of damage. Fair enough. Uh, Dirty 20 is up next. Shaft, uh, these do not look like loving creatures to you. No. Shaft informs everyone. Guys, Shaft feels that these creatures have lost the way. They must be destroyed. So Shaft will, Shaft will engage. And verbally really get mad at them. <laughs> Do you hey, fist? you guys, let go of your damn hand. <laughs> so let me let me get something straight, Chef. Did you actually learn how to, you know, use your fist at all? I, I've heard all these fabulous things about monks and how great they are at hitting things. Hey, can you, you ask him that after he punches something? <laughs> He's not going to. No, I, I'm going to verbally admonish them. He's going to friggin', he's not going to punch him. Why do you think I'm asking that right now? You know what? Your chances of living through the campaign are at like fucking zero. I just he's want you not to know gonna, that. I hope you're not bringing this character into the campaign. because 16 right. is up next. Work. Luna, you're up. Uh, God. Wait, did any, wait, did any of them take damage yet? Uh, yes. Uh, boss okay. Pants. Then I target that one with Toll the Dead. Same thing, Wisdom 13. Another four. Make it I... into three. Or wait a Good. minute. Yeah, make it into three. All right. And that's going to be 12. I rolled a 12 on a D12. So 12 points of damage. And then bong, bong, bong. 16. Uh, still up. What? Right. Still up. Damn. Donde esta la biblioteca? Uh, Russell, you're up, and there's one coming at you. Um, cool. I guess I'll attack the one coming for me. And that is a 25 to hit. Yep. With my sword. <coughs> uh, seven plus four, 11 damage. So half. Was that five or six? Five. 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 All right. Five on number two. These guys are armed with spears, moss pants. Yo. Uh, 11 plus 5, 16. Just hits me. Russell. Four plus five. That's a no go. Luna. Three plus 
three plus five is an eight and uh shaft 10 plus five 15. Actually, it's 30s. My AC is 16. Ties hit, right? Ties hit. Ties hit. So, yeah. so tie. hit, hit you both. Hit. Two plus two. Four damage to shaft. Four damage to moss pants. Taking Ow. us to top of the order, moss pants. Yours is not looking good, but of course it's got swamp shit hanging out of it. <laughs> oh, that's a 16 to hit. And that's going to be seven points of damage. Good enough to knock the bones down, scattering them everywhere. Natural 20 or dirty 20 shaft, your verbal admonishment did not seem to do well against the non-hearing creatures. What would you like to do? Shaft feels the first path should always be that of non-violence. However, Shaft now informs the team that he is forced to fully employ the way and he actually will punch fair enough since you got the shaft what? last round go ahead and hit it you oh. do that you hit things what yes um 18 18 hit uh, some well hit some well that's a, it's that's an 18 plus 5 so it's a 23 um and then 4 plus 7 that's 7 hit points and then as a bonus action, unarmed strike, another one. That's going to be a nat one. That's going to be a four. So, uh, roll a d4. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, Rob, uh, when, when we roll ones, three. we hit somebody. Uh, three is Luna. You punch Luna in the head. What? Consequences. Actions have consequences. Yeah. You that's punch some... three in the head? You were Seven standing too close to a tall fella. <clears throat> That's, that's it. Um, that's seven hit points. Damage halved, so three. So yeah, when you hit a friendly, your damage is halved. Uh, that takes Luna, us it was to... destined. So Shaft. Luna, you are yeah, not, you are not really forward. Oh, uh. The monk shafted you this time. I can't believe Shaft is such them. a violent man. You're supposed to hit them, not me. And I do. Shaft, oh yeah. Shaft doesn't have a lot of control over these terrible weapons. As I said, it, didn't they no teach you to hugs things? Did you fall asleep in monk school that day when they taught fighting? No, no. I've been cloistered in my in my monk. Hit him again! Hit him again! Who is Shaft, it? My turn. Shaft has been studying his yep. whole life. Shaft oh, is hurting shit. other people. I got, a, I got a skeleton right there, huh? Yep. Then I pull out a mace and I'm going to friggin' try to hit it. I'm going to try to hit it. Oh, Shaft actually, I am, well. I am going to hit it because that's a 14 to hit. And I'm using a mace, which is a bludgeoning weapon. Yep. It's a d6. Let's use a vertical blow die, shall we? Oh, that's not awesome, but that's four points of damage. But at least it all goes through. Yours? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. That's fair. Uh, Russell. Cool. I'm going after the one on me. And that is a 16 to hit? Yep. All right. Cool. And damage is six plus four, 10. So five damage again. Got it. Uh, everybody but Moss Pants has one on them. <clears throat> so on Russell, two plus five, Jesus. Luna, seven plus five, 12. No. No. I've got good nat, armor. Nat 20, you shaft. You're getting yeah. a shaft again. <laughs> shaft takes four more hit points as he gets the shaft of the spear, taking us to Moss Pants. Well, I'm going to slip over and aid Stop. the cleric. Everybody roll perception check. What? Okay. Ugh. 15. Dirty 15. 13. 11. 6. Uh, shaft, moss pants. You hear the ever familiar sound of a buzzing of a giant wasp coming in somewhere. Uh, moss pants, you are up. My I'm pin protects me from flying creatures. Still going to aid the cleric. I'll step over and wank it. And I'm going to go two-handed with the quarterstaff this time. 
because <coughs> that ups the damage. <coughs> I forgot versatile. <laughs> uh, it's a 17 to hit and eight points of damage. That's 19. Still up. Uh, dirty 20, Shaft. Uh, for some reason, it's coming right for you again. So you have a giant wasp and a skeleton. Uh, that's a nat 20, by the way. So you're welcome. That wasn't an attack. Yes, yes. yes. There's Burn not those much on other checks. left uh, that, 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 that the shaft has. But shaft will have, uh, will have two unarmed strikes against the, uh, against the skeleton. First is an eight plus five, 13. Hits. Just on the nose. This is the way, Shaft. This is the way. That's, this is the way. The Shaft agrees. The Shaft is the Shaft. It's seven more hit points of bludgeoning damage. Okay. That's the first attack is a bonus action. That's a nat 20. Yeah. Damage, damage modifier. Well, I'm rolling a lot of fours on this D4. It's D4 plus three. That's seven. What? Um, so I roll the four. What, what's the damage modifier of that? You roll another four or a D four. Okay. So four plus plus no three that time. Okay. So uh seven plus three is gonna be ten. Ten hit points. Still alive. Uh and the giant wasp is closing. Luna. Uh since this thing is still on my face, I can't really cast with it in my face. I'm going to have to try again, hitting it with my mace. Did that rhyme? All right, that's going to be even more than last time. That's a 17. Hit. Come on, murder hobo to die. Oh, that's a three. That is enough to bring yeah. down the skeleton, Russell. By the way, I want to move back a bit okay. to make it harder for them to get to me, if that, so I can cast again. Hopefully, I can <coughs> take down the skeleton. Uh, let's see. That is a tw modified 21 to hit for three plus four, seven, have three damage. Is it down? Is it down? Damn it. I thought that three it, damage would do it. It is not down. The one that you just attacked attacks you. Nat 20. Uh, right. The rolls are coming in and uh -oh. I'm going to use the murder hobo die. Seven damage, seven big damage. Uh, on shaft, this is the skeleton. 12 plus 517. Giant wasp. Three. Jeez. Highs and lows. Uh, six damage to shaft as he is yet again shafted. Uh, bringing and us shaft is down. Okay, uh, we'll for, take care of that. We'll take care that's of that. That's for your low position. To Stomp on him, Russell. Uh, Moss <laughs> Pants, you're up. You see the monk fall. And what's the situation with uh, other creatures attacking my party members? We have one on Russell and a skeleton and a giant wasp now ignoring Shaft and going after to be determined. I thought the skeleton went down. It was just the wasp left on Shaft. No, the skeleton that was fighting Luna went down. That was oh, the one that got kill off. Yeah, oh. uh, Shaft's oh. skeleton has 17, so it's not long for this world. I'm sliding over to... Uh, the next position uh, is the one on Russell closer or is the other one that was with them? The one on Russell is closest. That's next up. That skeleton's got to go down. I don't even care about the wasp. There's a skeleton here. Go um, for it. Two-handed. Oh, no. That's only an eight. Ah, oh, damn it. It's not uh, an at one, right? Swing and no. miss. Shaft. First death no, no, save. No. It was a seven. I don't think I've ever rolled a death save before. What do I do? D20, uh, 10 or better. Yeah. That's if they it. had a finesse staff, I'd be doing a lot better. Nope, that's a four. Okay, uh, one, fail. one failure. Uh, Luna, you're up. As I said, I'm going to take care of that little problem. I know it means I'm going to get closer to bad things, but I don't have a choice. So then I'm going to uh, go to spells here. 
And I'm, I have a circle of mortality. So that's good. Yeah, which means I just do the maximum possible on somebody that, that's at here at zero hit points. So what you is my... have to my... touch them now? Yeah, I'm going to run up and touch them. Uh, I'll do what I got to do. I'm still up. I'm only down. The only, hit points, the only hit points I'm missing are the ones that shafted to me, actually. All right, so I run up <laughs> and I go... Uh, there's no room go, for caution. I go, get up, you fool. We need you. And I'm going to do, uh, was it 11 points back? Trigger's lactate <laughs> stat. <laughs> Shaft's eyes blink open and he sits bolt upright. Holy shit, what's going on? Russell. That's right. All right. Right, in the, right in the chest. Uh, <laughs> so skeleton stall me. Cool. Uh, I, made, I made Shaft rise, huh? Ooh, Ooh, and that is a the... two, so I miss. And that's another two. <laughs> it's not a one. It is not a one. It's a two. Thank you so much. I'm standing really uh, close. To first off, odd, <laughs> even, odd, moss pants, even, Russell. Bring it. Stinging, stinging with Russell. Seven plus five, 12. <laughs> nope. Uh, scene shafts. Enormous rise. Yeah, odd, shaft odd, rose. Odd even. Odd goes after Luna for the skeleton. Ha. 18 plus five. Let's break out a murder hobo die. Who is there? Who are you hitting? Me? You. Who? Seven. Uh, don't, 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 uh, don't. How much damage? Seven. Strangely enough, Shaft, the giant wasp is still on you. Oh no. Strangely enough, I have rolled my 42nd four and it <laughs> fails. Uh, moss pants, another round. I believe I just saw the cleric crumple. Oh, uh, no, I'm, I'm <laughs> up, I'll hit it. I look awful. Two handed swing against the skeleton again. That's got to go away. Uh, that is a 16 to hit. Uh, and that is. I'm blind, so that's uh, seven points of damage. That is enough to knock it into a pile of bones as and well. And I'm heading toward, getting close to the other one before I end my turn on movement. Fair enough. Uh, shaft. Holy crap. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I saw the way. <laughs> you have shaft. a giant wasp on you. Shaft will take a look at the wasp who is normally his friend. But... Tracking him! damn thing I'm, if you gotta end this i'm about to die you idiot wow <laughs> i'm a one hit point right, that's guys. A, that's i've got that's jerky a, that's a 13 that's a 13 on the wasp i got me we can take a rest too if we need to that's six hit points on the wasp still alive he uh, has a bonus action um that no even. that that won't be enough that's that's eight that's an eight for <laughs> Yeah, not sorry. enough. Luna with one hit point. You're Fucking up. Fucking hell! It's not, not and he's. I assume he's with the melee of me too, right? Oh yeah, he stepped up and <clears throat> gave you the shaft. Fuck. <laughs> I hate doing this because it means I got to burn my whole action doing it, but I'm disengaging. I'm going to disengage enough. and pull back. I. I, I Brilliant I, move! I've one got hit it. point, man. Luna pulls I know out. You're gonna... Russell, you're up. <laughs> <coughs> that way, you did this better right. shaft pulled out. But I'm, you know. I'm happy with either a nat 20 or a nat 1 right now. <laughs> oh, wait. Do I get to re-roll a, a 1 again? Uh, yes. Lucky. <laughs> you're lucky. You get to re-roll every nat 1. Really? That's how that... <laughs> but you have to keep the following score. Okay, cool. So that was a nat 1. <coughs> Let's re-roll. The following score is a four plus six. So does a 10 hit? <laughs> Damn it. Uh, the skeleton? Yeah. No. That's unfortunate. Uh, uh, the, I swing my sword wildly. The skeleton will go after odd uh, moss pants, even Russell. Odd moss pants. <laughs> Come to me, boy. 19 plus five, 24. Uh, the giant wasp. Will not leave Scott's side. That's better. That's a five. 
<laughs> so that is a miss. The skeleton does. I should have used the murder hobo die. One plus two is three on moss pants. Uh, and, Good. And it is back to you <laughs> on this elongated fight. Oh, it's back to me. Mm-hmm. Ha ha! That'll be a 20 dirty type. Uh, I was hoping for a one. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> you, you hit were the hoping skeleton. for a one. And it's nine points of damage. D8 plus eight plus one. Yes. That is enough to turn it into a pile of bones. Filthy uh, bastards. Next up, Shaft. What is it with you and the giant wasps? This, it, it, this is so painful. He, he, Shaft, Shaft cries. Shaft cries tears of, of, of pain. <laughs> I should have got. I'm going to cast Toll the Dead on Shaft. <laughs> Nat one. Oh my god! I'm glad I'm not. I'm glad I backed the fuck out of dodge. D six, one two, Moss Pants, three four, Russell, five six. You hit yourself. Oh thank God. Four. Russell. Oh <laughs> fuck you, Shaft. <laughs> Shaft's backswing pops you in the face. Russell, six. you're getting the shaft. Six halved? <laughs> six halved or six? No, I, I rolled the three plus three is six, so that'll be uh, three, so damage. Three. Yeah, three uh, damage. Yeah. Do you want to take your bonus action shaft bonus or do you action. not have one? No, I, I have one as long as I'm unarmed, and that's an 18. So that's uh, 18 plus five is 23. 23. And that's a four. That's seven on the. Uh, Knocks down the giant wasp. All of the assailants and aggressors are now down. Shaft, Shaft. give me an insight check. Shaft, before the insight, Shaft is so sad. He goes and he hugs Russell. Just hugs him. God is tugging Why is this happening? Why is this happening? I can understand that. This doesn't understand. That was a nat 20 on his insight. There's something in your pocket. Hey, Luna, can you heal me, please? <laughs> you may only have three hit points. Uh, <laughs> hey, 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 Russell, you have uh, two more hit points than I do. Right as, Shaft, as Shaft embraces his a- friend, he feels something in his pocket jabbing him. Is it a Shaft? It is a lead piece of jewelry in the form of a fly. Shaft takes a look at this and says, this is a gift. It will I, attract all of your flying friends. That is for sure. Th- this, this is a gift. <laughs> Thank I say you we let him so keep it. Much. Thank you so much, Brother Russell. I thought that perhaps Shaft thought that all of this meant nothing, but now Shaft can see there's a meaning for all of this. Wait, is that freaking thing actually attracting yeah, I figured out I attract us. things, and I used sleight of hand to slip in the shaft's bag. Oh, son of a so, bitch. <laughs> Which is why he was getting decked so much. So, yeah, that was good. <laughs> that so, is real. So, so he, he understands that, and, and, and Shaft is going to take a look at this and say, thank you for the gift, brother. Thank you for the gift. I think but we need welcome. to put that somewhere else so we can rest, because I think we need about an hour. Uh, Russell, if I'm on the campaign with you and you try that shit, I'm beheading you. (laughs) Please don't be on the campaign with me. (laughs) Uh, So we're taking a one hour rest? Yeah, Yeah, we're going to need I do not have enough spells. Shaq will take take this this beautiful little little token of of love, really, from Russell. Cool. Uh, Let's see if you get that rest in. Can you throw that somewhere? You'll get your rest in, oh, and you'll be God. visited. All right. I'm Shaft gonna make goes, everybody a little mm, bit of boss leg his... tartar. You gonna um, use your jerky yet? I'm gonna, gonna try go... and burn a hit dice first. Sure. I am de- will, yep, um, burning my hit die. No Shaft ones will, on your um, hit die roll. No that's ones. Seven plus. So that's what's my con back. bonus? Fuck. Can't I can't even get back to full man. Three is ten. Cool. That'll get me back. Uh, Shaft will run about. Shaft will run about sixty feet away from the rest of the party. Good. Bury the the insect in. Make a little grave for it. Go backwards. Like a little 
a little, a little, you know, a little yeah. thing of twigs, you know, like a, you know, little, you know, Carcosa little thing, t- twigs. And put I'm going to kill you in one of the next two encounters, aren't I? <laughs> Yeah, it probably sounds pray, like it. Pray over it. So when he comes back, while. there's a nice little plate of sushi for him, but it's made with wasp leg. I'm not going to tell him that. Nice. And and then and then come back and again just give a just rub little Russell's head like that. Thank you so much, brother. That was so special, so so special. And I rub his head maybe a little too long, but keep rubbing. <laughs> Russell, do you, need, do you need some of this jerky, Russell? I'm fine. Uh, no, I, I was able to heal up with that rust. Thank you, though. Hang on to that for an emergency. Oh, I'll put it back in my pouch. At this point, I'm going to take off my stupid um, poncho and just go with my lighter um, wearing crocodile hide studded leather armor. And I'm kind of decorated with bones all over and I'll pull the hood back. So I have like kind of a I have a mullet except the back of it's all in braids and the top is is chamfered off about three inches tall stands up and it's all green on top and the braids are all black you're joe dirt i'm kind of the joe dirt of hobbiton if you know what i mean nice. joe Dirte. <laughs> Every, everybody i definitely get dirty <laughs> dirty um Six. oh boy well at least it's now i rolled a one <laughs> me too <laughs> we should try one uh, a dead. stillness over the swamp, an unusual stillness. Moss pants will realize this. That's not good. Uh, as you look up, you notice <laughs> clouds circling above you as though you were in the eye of a storm. This is really not good. <laughs> Take cover if we can. Wait, we, we didn't we no want cover. To come- we didn't Chef, come... Chef starts taking off his clothes to welcome what's ever there. Wait, 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 wait. Was it windy or something before this passed overhead at some point? A little bit, but you guys were too busy fighting. I'm going to take out my necklace of zombie ears and that. clutch it. Sure. The shirt's off. <clears throat> uh, the clouds seem to be moving inland behind you. Uh since he is a ranger and since the swamp is his preferred territory, he will tell you there's a storm a coming. Get to the highest ground we can that's close by. And hold your butthole in the air so when the lightning hits, that's where it goes. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, why would you go high? You I stand arrow? about a foot away from shaft <laughs> and make sure I duck a little bit more than normal. <laughs> yeah, shaft is going to get If the shafted. lightning doesn't get you the flood will, but the flood is probably full of alligators and crocodiles. And Wait, and tarantulas, full. <laughs> and tarantulas and spiders and snakes. Uh, you look like if you proceed forward, kind of at a northeasterly angle, uh, it looks like you're going to go in between two waterways, or you can go into the waterways if you want. No, I think we should go between the two waterways. Fair <laughs> enough. And as fast as we can, <clears throat> which is a mighty twenty-five. The wind is starting to pick up uh, moss pants. You recognize the smell. It's salt air. Uh, you're probably we getting going close. the right way. Yeah, you're probably getting close, but the wind is really disconcerting. Uh, as you approach, after uh, moving down a little bit, you rediscover the trail and you head back through the uh, weeping willows by following stumps that line the path clearly. This is preordained as some kind of roadway. A light fog moves into the area with the wind and the area and ahead of the area you move, uh, but the silence is almost deafening. Some figures appear in the mist. That's all the mist. And they are not gorillas. That's what I thought. Wow. What do they look like? They look like zombies. Everybody roll oh, initiative. Oh, good I love Lord. it. You know, I went, you know, I'm not high enough level apparently where I can actually do anything with these things. That's a natural 20. 17. Uh, 11. Modified 20. Uh, my, 20 uh, my 20 gives me 24. Uh, your 20 is uh, good enough to go first. The four zombies uh, 
you know what? Judging from this group, they're looking for brains, so they might as well go the other way. Uh, but they pair off, <laughs> they score off uh, one on each of you. Go ahead. Oh, for fuck's sakes! I don't yeah, really well, want them on me. My uh, <coughs> my uh, fault happens to be there's no room for caution in a life lived fully. So it's short sword in each hand. I'm going in. Cool. Uh, that's a uh, 24, 18 plus six. You need an eight to hit these guys. Uh, you also notice they look like they're dressed as pirates. And that's eight points of damage to me, zombie. Rosa's old crew. Rosa <laughs> and her crew. Uh, no, next up there Rosa's is, uh, not a zombie. So tell me. Russell. <laughs> all right. Who knows how to divide 200 by three just in case? Uh, 200 by three. What is that? I don't know. I'm uh, not good at math. 60, yeah, like six, 60, eight, 60. No. Well, I'm just thinking that well, the monk might try and 18, hug a zombie yeah, and that six, doesn't six, turn out six. well. Oh, God, it's 666 six, six repeating, isn't it? Yeah, uh, yeah. that was uh, 19 to hit. Yeah, eight. These guys are easy to hit. Well, that's good. Eight damage. <laughs> uh, next up, 17. Shaft. Yeah, this could be will. a relative. Do you really want to hit Sha this thing? Shaft will <laughs> approach the zombies and start posing intimidatingly like, saying, go away. Go away. I mean, the zombie's approaching looking like it's about ready to give you a hug. <coughs> I don't think it's going to... I don't think it can... Except for the foot, it's but... dragon, but it looks pretty much like a hug, yeah. Yeah, not it looks like it's going the other way because it's twisted and back. Uh, Luna, not, that brings us to you. Nonviolence is a choice. Well, I'm gonna. It's a choice uh, every day. Sure, Martin. It's a choice <laughs> I don't have to take. That is true. That may no. be your way. That may be your way. When it comes to undead, there's no other way. Actually, that is can one I? Way. You know what? I'm honestly not sure about this, and I real I know I really should be. Uh, if I'm going to do something like a spell with a save, that I don't need to, I, I can do that, right? If it's in my face. All right. Make a, fine, I'm going to cast Sacred Flame. Make a dexterity save. Yes. Oh, that ain't going to be good. I know. That's why I'm going for Sacred Flame. Hell yeah. 11 to 9. All right. Just, well, just one. If you're the one on me. So. My roll was an 11. Uh, oh, it Drops went to, to a nine. 9. Yep. Okay, so I damage him. And so it's it's fire, so it'll be... Oh, fire bad. Uh, that is fire... Oh, wait, no, wait. That is uh, four points of fire damage. Uh, uh, it'd be my turn. <coughs> Zombie one on Moss Pants. Jesus Christ. Uh, it stumbles and falls flat at your feet. You will have advantage on it. Next roll, Russell. Nine plus three is 12. Nope. Luna. Wow. Two plus three is five. And oh, God. Shaft. Uh, 12 plus three is 15, Shaft. That'll hit me. Uh, I'm wow. I'm rolling like crap, so I'm going to the murder hobo die. Roll with it. Four. You didn't, was that damage. big red? Was that big red? No, I haven't. Start, I'm going to use big red from now on. There's your problem right there. Finish him. Four damage, Shaft. <coughs> uh, yeah. Start off with a big 24 for round two. Moss pants. Oh, that's it. I won't need the advantage. That's a 19 to hit and uh, plus nine more damage. Still alive. You, you know what? Tough. They take I'll, a lot of cutting. I'll, I'll give you advantage on your damage. So if you want to reroll damage, if it's better than that, you can have that. Oh. Okay. Ten more damage. Uh, still alive, but I can worse off. Uh, Shaft. Apparently, your uh, kumbaya love fest is not going well. You are certainly. Shaft. An odd fish playing this game. Shaft is, is he always just, is. Shaft is just heartbroken that this has to happen. 
Shaft doesn't understand the need for violence. <laughs> that's a two. And that's an 18. So the bonus hit, at, well, it's a dirty 18. So 23. And that's going to be a two plus that's five hit points of damage. And two tiers of pain. You swing and miss, but then punch him in the groin, knocking his Johnson to the ground. Uh, we're going to 11, Luna. All Russell, right. did you go? I don't think so. I don't think so. Hey, let's go with Russell. Yeah, first. I go. Yeah, I don't think so either. Uh, net 20. Yes. There you go. All right, let's see. Seven plus six. Plus four. 17. That is enough to put the zombie down. Uh, hmm. Luna, you're up. All right. I'm going to switch tactics and go to Toll the Dead instead. So, uh, because he's not missing hit points. So, make that save at 13. Uh, better roll, but not good enough. 10, not and I'm sure I got minuses there. Okay, so a D12, oh, and come on, stay on the table. But it's not a four. That's just 11 points of damage. It's like a boing. Nice. Uh, but it uh, doesn't kill him. My turn. That's unfortunate. Moss pants. Yeah. 18 plus three is 21. Oh, no. It's gonna hit Russell. Me. Now he's going to okay. murder us all. Luna, nine plus three is 12. No. Shaft. Mm. Nine plus three is twelve. So only uh, moss pants, and I am going with the root beer murder hobo. I'll get the root beer murder hobo later. Uh, four plus one is five. Wow, that hurts. That, that hurts. Is, you're up, moss pants. Uh, I'm gonna kill it and stick my short sword right through its head. Uh, that's a 16 to hit and 10 damage. <laughs> you do indeed lop off its head. Uh, Shaft, what you talking about? We, we must, Shaft must do what Shaft hates to do. That's a two. His primary misses is bonus. Again, uh, the, his, okay, so that's a 15 on the bonus action on arm strike. You know, you only needed eight to hit these guys. <laughs> yeah. That, twice. That, yeah. My dice uh -huh. don't like those numbers. Yeah. I, I rolled a two plus, uh, plus five is a seven. So, you know, okay. uh, so I only hit once and that's a three plus three. So six hit points of bludgeoning damage. Fair enough. Uh, Do I get to go this turn? You know, I'm just going to keep skipping you. So sure. All right. Time. Sounds, sounds good. I, I, I keep looking at the old initiative, not the new initiative. Right. Go ahead. Yeah, I'm gonna go and help out Luna. Okay. Ah, my hero. Uh, sixteen to hit <coughs> for eight damage. That's not bad. Luna may need to be freed up. Okay, Luna, you're up. All right, I'm gonna do that again. So make another wisdom save of thirteen or better. Fail again, damn it. 18, uh, wisdom ah! minus two, so yeah, 16. Yeah, no, yeah, I was going to say an 18 is going to be high, even with minuses. It's so a 13. Bring out crystal ball. <coughs> How much damage? Hey, it's none because it's a cantrip, so it's save a suck. That uh, sucked. Odd Russell, even Luna. Oh, and with a six, Luna. <clears throat> I love the crystal, but it's not easy. Uh, 16 plus 3 is a 19. Oh, yeah, that is. Shaft. 9 plus 3 is 12 again. Uh, nope. Root beer die this time on Luna. Uh -oh. Boom. 6 plus 1, 7. Not <laughs> good. That's not good. <laughs> Murder Hobo, baby, coming through. Thank you, Pirate Dog Dice. Uh, top of the order. Moss pants, two zombies left. Luna's looks really bad. Uh, shafts, eh, it's okay. Gut zombie belongs to me now. I'll take shafts zombie for 
for 200. Uh, <laughs> what is it's going to kill him, Alex? 25 to hit and a uh, what is three plus four again? Seven damage. Not bad. Uh, Shaft, you're getting a little bit of help now. You want to try and hit this thing and end its miserable existence? Shaft hates to, but Shaft will have to. Oh, man, it's so much better on the 14, other side. Four, that's 19 uh, and seven hit points of damage. And then Good. the bonus is going to be five plus five is a 10. And three plus three is six hit points. So it's a total of 13 hit points on two hits. More than enough to kill it. And I have yet again skipped over Russell. <laughs> but okay. there's still a zombie. It's, I, I put the initiatives here and here. My apologies. So uh, there's just the zombie left on Luna. Did I hear that? Correct. Correct. Okay. Very bad. It's well, that junk it. And was a 17 plus six to hit 23. So yeah. Yep. Eight more damage. Dead. Woo. Everything's dead. Everything is dead. I, I go back to the first zombie and cut an ear off and add it to my necklace. And then I go to the second zombie and I cut an ear off of it and offer it to Shaft. Like Shaft will with take utter the sincerity. Ear. Really? Shaft will take the ear. And, wow. and, and he's not wearing much right now. He's only wearing a loincloth. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> And, and he puts it in the only place where he can. It just keep it close to you. <laughs> you We're know like what? Give now. us the ring. Give us the ring. We have I, I want wanted... together. We're like brothers now. Brothers. I want to take a, a trophy too. Seeing, seeing moss pants, I'm going to try something similar. I'm going to go and chop off a foot and then uh, chop off another foot. So two feet. No. I'm going to give. I got some advice for you, son. A foot to shaft. <laughs> I've got a bit of advice for you. Pick smaller body parts. One foot, fine. Wait till you get like 17, 18 feet. They don't hang well. You know, um, they I, smell I, a lot more. Ears, dry and cartilaginous. They don't smell much and they last a long time. You also know, put a lot of them on one necklace. You know, have we, we've heard tales. I've heard tales about this. I think it was a druid. A druid that would cut dicks off of people and wear the modern necklace. I only did that one time. I've heard of that. One no. time. <laughs> she, she's been has, on here once and once at Gen Con. Shaft has sworn off all physical pleasures of the body. I, that's I, a that's shame. Shaft, would, <laughs> shaft would understand why one would do that because There's nothing wrong with that. Shaft I've got like 15 years. Understand why why that would be done and, and shaft turns to russell thank you again brother these are two gifts you're I welcome i don't have a place for this russell um, uh roll a 2d4 <laughs> for me please 2d4 uh 2d4 2d4 <coughs> six six gold pieces fall out of the foot that you severed off out of the boot what? Out of mine or the one that I gave Shaft? Out of yours. Well, that's nice. I'm going to shake it a little bit more and check. Actually, there, I gave the another boot to Shaft. Too. Doesn't matter. I, I shake it, see if there's anything else. Uh, Shaft. to loot the other bodies, too. Yeah. Each, each one will have 2d6, but only in one shoe. Oh. Okay, so we so we ah, saw so I'll, 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 I'll check my, I'll check the one I killed or the one that attacked me. It'll 2D have two d six or two d four. Sorry, two d four gold. Well, that's not as good. Uh, Shaft I'm, will not check the other boot. I Shaft, am not saying <laughs> that. That not makes that perfect sense. Shape. I got to add a whole two gold to my inventory here. Where's my other four? There you go. I'm using Pirate Dog Dice right now. It's a five. But I'll take five. I'm using my sexy Swamp Green Chessex Dice. 
Nice. Oh, those are nice. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> Thought Swamp Ranger, Swamp Dice. Yeah, but they're no pirate dog dice. <laughs> no, I don't have yeah, that. I, I, I got my they're green no murder hobo dice. You got my green no, murder hobo dice. But I here, might, yeah. I might fix that. Yep. I oh, am that. using. I like if I didn't I have the chat on, some I'd be able to see that. I'm sorry. I'm using some uh, pirate dog dice along with. I find the D20 really only rolls well for the one character it was made for, but the other dice. Seem to work and, and chess X dies <coughs> right, right here in Indiana, up in Fort Wayne. Oh, that's so, cool! Shout out to chess, they will not let me tour their facility, sadly, uh, because I did ask. Uh, oh, bummer, OSHA rules, man. Bummer, yeah. yeah, uh, so moss pants, uh, you can lead the group in between the water. You'll notice that there is a land strip to the right. I, uh, there is a shorter land strip to the left with again passage over a water feature. Uh, give me a perception check. Oh, I have advantage on those. Ha <laughs> <laughs> That was great. Okay. Seven. You don't know which way to go. Uh, I've had this problem once before. Find a tree. Is there a tree in my sight line? Oh, yeah. There's plenty of trees. Uh, pick up a good tall one. You said there was magnolias around. So those you know, things like magnolias that. and yeah. weeping willows. Well, whatever I can get up in a goodly ways and take a peer about. Give me an acrobatics check as you climb the tree. Well, okay. Straight dexterity. Sure. Uh, 14. Yeah, you climb up to the top. Uh, you notice tendrils of smoke to the left. And can I like smell an ocean breeze or? Uh... You can see the ocean breeze. Oh. Yeah, at the top. All right. You're very close. Let's head to the coastline. Um, on my way down, I'd like to take a look as I go down through the canopy and see what I can see ahead of us. Trees. Uh, I'll also take another dexterity check to get down. That one is going to be a nat one. Yeah, you get I'm down. lucky. Ah. I'm lucky. Oh, oh, that's right. I'm not that lucky. Is it another I take one? The se- I take the second nat one. <laughs> well, good news. Uh, you get down really fast. Now roll, yeah. A, yeah. now roll a D4. If it's a one, you're going to land in the water or in the mud. If it's a two, Russell... You're going to three land on Luna or a four you land on. Shaft. Oh God, don't land on me. Uh, I land on shaft. Shaft, take D6 damage, not halved. Oh uh, God. Moss pants, take D6 damage, not halved. Shit, we're going to. I'll take that one. <laughs> we're going to be hurting. That was five hit points of damage for me. <laughs> and one for me, bringing me to seven. But I'm going to uh, snap a piece of jerky in half and hand half to Shaft and put the other half in my mouth and start chewing. God damn it. Do you take it, Shaft? I do take it, yes. I, I chew it. Do you eat it? Absolutely. As do soon as I finish it. getting the juiciness oh, out, do I, I swallow spit it, it out. Um, come on, did you be three feet tall? Like come on, do you swallow or do you spit? <laughs> yeah, shaft. Does your shaft swallow or spit? Vegan, you better not swallow if you're vegan. Sha- I don't shaft. think it works that shaft way. Doesn't, sh- shaft doesn't really Animal work byproducts. Um, th- this, he, just the idea of eating the flesh of another creature is, is quite... Ugh, ugh. So you, don't you, you tell him what was in the spit. sushi. Uh, D4 plus two, no ones. Healing. Five. I'll take five. Back. Only four. Got some of them back. Ooh, almost there. Awesome. Okay. They have a reddish brown hue around their lips. Uh, persuasion checks will be at minus one. Uh, so uh, before the have fall. You see me. Before the fall, you know that you need to go left, which means crossing the water feature. Well, I'll probe along the bank with my staff looking for the best place to 
cross and see if there's a fording point. Also you, looking for crocodiles the whole way. You find the fording point, but on the other side, you see the fleshy, partially destroyed remains of something and a big flowery captain's hat. There's also hunks of wood lying around the death scene. Is it awesome. moving? No. Okay. Could be. <clears throat> I'll uh, probe my way across the water, staff in one hand, short uh-huh. sword in the other. Frank? Yes, ma'am? I would like to use uh, Eyes of the Grave to make sure there isn't anything over there. What do Eyes of the Grave tell Un- you? Undead, for starters. Um, nope. Hang on. No undead, okay. And so it says uh, uh, undead within 60 feet of you that isn't behind, oh, total cover and isn't protected from divination magic. Nope, no undead. Okay. Darn it. <clears throat> so then knowing I'm going to be safe, I want to, once again, I want to ride the shaft, baby. To crest over this water. Shaft. Do shaft, you want to shaft, use my shaft. raincoat as protection? Re- remember sure. that he's naked right now. No, he's going to like him. I don't I'll, care. I'll, I'll, I'll pull my rain poncho his... and throw it back to her so she can uh, put something between her and the shaft. Yeah, yeah I, and I'll be on, I'm on his shoulders. It's not like I'm on the bottom part. I'm anywhere well, near Well, right near part. the head of the shaft. I mean, That's right. Know, I'm right near the shaft. head of the shaft. You never know what's going to leak out of that. <laughs> right when you're that high, you're going to get wet. That's well, why you, you need know, the poncho. That's right. I'm going to take the poncho for protection. It's the right size for you. Nope. You don't need protection from the shaft. Why not? Trust me, you need protection from the shaft, Lassie. You know, I've seen know, what can happen. You know, if, if like if a zombie went and opened his brain up, then I'm sure something liquid would come out of the top of the head of the shaft. Head, sp- the shaft spends a good amount of his time rubbing oil all over his. Oh God! Yes, I put. Then I put it to, make, to make sure that every that that no foul. Anything can stick to the skin. You know, yeah. Shaft shaves completely. You yeah, know but that. He's got all a of it. Thong. Is it a all thong it. or is all. it just a. It's a loincloth. It, it's, it's a loincloth. Like, so we don't like, see all that. Well, I, I mean, it's like a thong loincloth. So it's like some leather straps and then like a pouch. He looks like a slave boy from. <laughs> oh, it's, it's Jesus's G string. That's right. No, I don't have that kind of loincloth shaft. It's entirely different. <laughs> His looks a like a loin bush. Cloth. <laughs> no, Lord. Oh, His looks like a baby. frog hiding in the moss. <laughs> you know, I saw some tribesmen once. They had these things with a big flute up there. They wore just like that. Uh, Russell, are you going to cross okay. with them? Russell, Russell, the shaft must put down the boot that you gave me in order to, in order to have Luna, ride the shaft. The shaft needs to put the foot down. I, I hope you can forgive me. I hope you can forgive the shaft. <laughs> we are no longer friends. She's just oh, holding it in your mouth. I'll hold on to it, okay? Jeez, hold, I hold the foot in your mouth, lad. Right, eh. oh. If you oh. value our friendship, you will keep that foot for the rest of your life. No, 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 no. I'll hold on to the foot, okay? okay. No, so Luke, no, Luke, no, Luke, no, 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 the shaft the has, a, the staff has a better <laughs> idea. And, and, and well, no, the shaft no, has a better idea. The shaft idea. has a better idea. I'm going to hold on to the shaft with my hand. Luna he's holds gonna, on to the shafts. He's going hand. to, <laughs> the shaft will clinch. Oh, somebody. No, no, no. Let's, let's just cross the water. That'll right. have your <laughs> movement. <laughs> <laughs> can I can I jump across? Can I yes. <laughs> clenching you cuts and, your you movement and, in half? You and Moss Pants need a acrobatics or dex check. Acrobatics. Uh that is a 15. 17. Both of you clear it. Uh Luna while holding shafts 12 inches. I mean foot. Uh cross over the water feature. You notice that uh the Depo- or a decomposing body appears to have a big feathery <laughs> hat, kind of like a pirate captain. Mm. Uh, there's a uh-huh. lot of shattered wood, and there's a <coughs> piece of wood that uh, where's my D4? Uh, We're talking about wood and shafts, huh? That's right. Shaft finds the wood, and it says 
the curmudgeon. Mm. I'm going to take the feathers. Okay. Uh, there is a variety of mundane items here. Bolt of silk, several silver candlesticks, broken pottery, uh, and a small chest. Any healing potions? Got to open the chest to find out. Open the chest. I'm not good at opening that. If anybody else here is good at it, go for it. I'm going to try and open the chest. I stand back, though. You open up the chest, and there are several potion bottles in there, all of which have been broken uh, from the loose coins that have spilled forth from the sack. Everybody roll initiative at disadvantage because you're apparently all paying attention to the wrong thing. What? 14. Fifteen. Oh, goody! Plus three is I rolled a nineteen and a fifteen plus three, so that's going to be an eighteen. We're out of the swamp now. I've got no idea. Cleric speed of ten. Russell, seventeen. <clears throat> well, the good news is Shaft catches movement out of the corner of his eye, as does Russell. Shaft, something hovers this way. It is a bulbous creature. With several eye stalks atop of it, the bulb itself has a God. giant eye in it, Damn. and it seems Damn. to be making a beeline towards you. It is within uh, ten feet. This Just looks, stand your ground. This thing, this thing is alive, right? Oh yeah, it's floating and moving. We're first level. Chef knows. Chef knows what this is. It's his mother. It's the flying spaghetti monster. <laughs> no, it, I knew it. I, I knew it. this is this is destiny. Shaft will walk confidently towards this eye, this central eye. This is this eye that that is going to point him to the way. I have a feeling and this isn't going to be good. Walks right towards the eye and waves. Uh, Russell, you are up with a 17. Um, <laughs> you know what? I, I don't see <coughs> things 10 feet in front of us. Shaft just, you know, approached. So, you know what? I'm going to stay 10 feet away out of melee. I, I'm okay with this right now. Fair enough. Uh, next up is the 14 moss pants. I'm going to get as far back as I can and pull my bow out. Uh, that'll make you at 11 feet. Uh, otherwise, you're going into the drink. Oof. Uh, well, at least at 10 feet, I can use my bow. <laughs> That's true. And I will stay right close to the water's edge, but keep an ear out. Uh, I beat Luna. I will move towards three. Luna, I make a beeline towards her. Go fucking. Wah, 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 wah. Luna, I'm you're up. Oh, that's all you do? Mm-hmm. God, is this thing freaking real? Ah. Uh, my God. Well. No, to do. Yet. No, I know. Na, 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 na. Thanks, Alex Trebek, for all those years. Thank you, Alex Trebek. I know. Um, God, I yeah, I'm friggin' hurt too. Uh, Darn. I'm gonna. Wah, 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 all wah, right, wah, I'm gonna wah, cast. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> all right, it has not attacked yet. I'm gonna cast. Jeff says, "Don't hurt words. it." Don't hurt it. This is my brother. This is my brother in the way. This thing is not your brother. But I I'm going to cast. His mother. I am going to say. Brother. brother. I, I, if I said mother, I was wrong. Brother. It's my brother I, in the way. I have nothing else. I got to. All gotta those eyes. It has to know the way. Uh, what do I do? Okay, so that's I. I have to cast cure wounds on myself. I, I'm at three hit points, folksy. So, okay, now at least I'm back close to full. Top of the order, uh, uh, 18. 
Can I screw up the initiative again? No, Shaft is 18, right? Yeah, Shaft yeah, is 18. You're 17, <clears throat> Moss Pants is 14, 14, and Luna's 10. Okay, so Shaft, you're up. Shaft calls out to his brother. Brother Shaft, please, please show us the way. Oh, God. The way apparently is through Luna, so Shaft needs to go through Luna. <laughs> <laughs> 17, Russell. This is the gift that keeps on okay. giving, folks. So I, I want to understand the layout. Did this floating thing just totally like bypass some people and just head towards Luna? Bypass Shaft and you, uh, and then Moss Pants backed up, but uh, it headed towards Luna. So right All for right. the grave, Claire. Oh, it bypassed me. Okay, okay. I didn't um, come, my brother. Okay. I, I, I didn't catch that. Okay. Uh, I'm getting tired of this. Uh, am I behind it? Yeah. Can I do... Uh, it does I, have eyes that are moving uh, around. So it's not going to be a surprise or anything if I... It will not be a surprise. Attack. Nope. I attack. And that is a 24 to hit. The gas spore is AC5 with one hit point. Everybody, oh. everybody DC 15 versus Constitution, including Moss Pants as is spores. This poison? Yes, it is. Oh, I'm a stout halfling. I'm a stout halfling. <laughs> We're both stout halflings. <laughs> what is it, Constitution? Yep. Okay, so I lose the nat 20. Nope. Well, no, I, I get to keep the nat 20 because it's advantage, yep. 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 I'm using the Murder Hobo Ink Dice. That was an eight for me. You guys Seven. got lucky. 17. If you made the saving throw, you take three damage. If you failed the saving throw, you take seven. I take two damage. Well, it's a good Russell. thing I healed myself because I'd be friggin' dead. Stout halflings. Stout, Shaft. stout halflings. Shaft, Dead. Shaft, are amazing. Shaft, Shaft is down. Shaft, Shaft is covered in spores. Shaft. Have you considered Shaft becoming an outlander, Russell? <laughs> I cast. I'm going to cast Spare the Dying. Because that's Come all I got. Come with me left. to my village. You know what? That that's enticing. Is that a bunch of short people? Uh, we're all stout halflings. Well, there's two kobolds and a goblin, but they're just pets, basically. That sounds amazing. I, I may take you up on the offer. Thank you. L Luna, does that stop poison? Oh, shit. No, I mean, no, it, it makes them stable, but... Okay. I can uh, Well, basically, I can keep them alive because if the friggin' poison does damage, I stabilize them. So I assume that resets any death saves or anything like that, right? It does. If I keep stay So, I mean, it's a cantrip, so I can just keep doing it. Uh, Russell, Luda, Moss Pants, Perception. Um, oh my god, we need to get the fuck out of here. Nat 20, I perceive the spores, right? Is that what you're going to say? Uh, uh, you know, if you use the spores properly, you can get a really good hallucination from them. 22. Colors, man. Co co colors. Uh, Look at the pretty purple. The town of Wenton Springs is within eyesight. Maybe three football fields away. Um, somebody... Now is when it gets dangerous. We're leaving nature and going into where the man's got control. Well, we kind of need to. I mean, I'm in. I, I I'm agree. In the lure really of gold pieces shape. is amazing. No, I'm in bad shape. Okay, I'm barely standing myself, and we need to get him. We need to get him in there to get treatment. Shaft, aka grow box. <laughs> Wait, is Shaft down? Yes. Shaft is down. Well, the Shaft is down. The, and the, he's taking the, poison the damage. Is, the Shaft is horizontal. I've got Basically, a I'm casting French gas. I'm stabilizing him every round. Because okay, he's I've got poison. a tarp. We'll build a travoy and drag him to town. <laughs> Good thunk. Good thunk. <laughs> I stay uh, better than being carried by two stout halflings. True. You guys uh, carry him on the tarp, uh, drag him three, or I'm sorry, 900 feet, or no, 900 yards. 
900 yards. Slowly. And make it, and make it to Wenton Slowly. Springs. It has been Slowly. It, it has been hit by a hurricane, uh, and people Careful. are just now starting to clean up. Uh, one woman uh, looks at you and goes, what is going on? We came to bring a message, and we need help. He needs help, especially. Give me the can't message. Can't do anymore. Who are you? I am Miranda Coates. Yeah, and oh, yeah, that's the one. Whoever has the message. Well, Shit, we, we forgot get to get the message. <laughs> no, that's we have the message. She opens it up and goes, yeah. oh, tell my lover, the mayor of Noblesville, I'm fine. Now, what's wrong with your friend? <laughs> He's... He's been poisoned. Oh, stabilized, okay. stabilized. I don't know if it's he's chucking it off at all. I assume he's D twelve against me there, Luna. I assume he keeps may have to keep making saves. Can can I I uh, distract Luna eight. for three rounds? No, <laughs> no, eight. Four. I pay. No, you can't do that. They they will call for the witch slash alchemist. To How long does up. it take her to get there? That's a good question. Six rounds. <laughs> <laughs> Three by 200 is 66. I can tell you what. I'll take 65. 65 what? Gold pieces. Yeah, we were supposed to get paid. Yeah, we're, we're supposed to get oh, paid yeah, two, for this two, message. 200 gold pieces. That's right. Yeah. She'll pay you. So you're going to take out Yeah, we're shafts. splitting shafts. That's, that's the logic. <laughs> <laughs> We're taking shafts, buddy. We're gonna shaft Aye, them. The two of you take sixty-six. I'll take sixty-five. Okay, that's fair. We're all small together. Yeah, I you like could both idea. come back to my village. While he shafts unconscious, <coughs> uh, unconscious, I'm gonna take that little pin that attracts <laughs> flying things. No, he buried it. I'm, he buried I... it. He buried that. He buried went and it. retrieved it, though. You never said you did. You did retrieve it. Yeah, he did he? he messaged me. Yeah. Oh, I, we don't I, have... I rolled a 19 on sneak. And, How did and we get no more it. bugs? I'm happy well, we get them more we, bugs. We were lucky. But luckily, since Shaft is unconscious and he won't notice this, <laughs> I'm going to pop it up his only place that he can carry things. <laughs> oh, wait. Wait. You can just pin it to the loincloth. No. Do you no. really want to put your hand there? That's not where he's putting it. Yeah, but would you really want to put your hand there? One use thumb is hand, okay. You use a hollow reed. You use that. You put the pin in the hollow reed and push it far up there. <laughs> far up there. You blow dart that thing up there. Uh, no, no. I just want to make sure that it can't be easily buried <laughs> anytime soon. It'll, it'll be buried in about six hours. Yeah, six hours. <laughs> Do we manage to save them at least? You managed to save him and have reached Wenton Springs and delivered the message and Yay. for three we of got you paid. gotten paid. Yeah. Uh, all in all, a successful, albeit close call for young adventurers. Uh, we'll start with Scott. Scott, final thoughts. Well, um, that was a lot of fun as, as, as uh, usual. Um, I, I, I wanted to play a pacifist to see if I could get through an entire game without 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 doing any combat at all. Not with um, Have you met and, me? <laughs> <laughs> and, and, I, and I made it through part of it. I was hoping that his high armor class would, you know, relatively speaking, a high armor class <laughs> would help against other relatively non-high strength characters um, and such as that. But eventually the odds do weigh out. And, and he's not an idiot. You know, he'll, he'll, he'll defend himself, but he wasn't going to initiate. Uh, so a pacifist monk who speaks in the third person, um, you know, I thought would be an interesting thing to play. I probably won't play him again because he's really annoying. But um... <laughs> <laughs> really, I didn't catch that part. <laughs> but as usual, it's always fun playing with you guys. Always. Uh, Carol, what'd you think? Oh, God, that was so good. Uh, yeah, I always enjoy these one shots. Uh and the crazy of the bad. Yes, you were annoying, you know, Scott, but honestly, it's par for the course for Murder Hobo Inc. Um, I, no, your character was a ton of fun. Uh, it, it, 
Don't ever well, ever change, Scott Van. Although I like Luna though. I like Luna because she's she's yeah. so she's so based upon trying to pass things to the other side. And and Toll the yeah. Dead is a very potent cantrip oh, at, it's, at lower levels. At very, low very levels, awesome. it's really yeah, good. Really, really good. And, really, really and, you, good and you do have to know how to use you have to know how to use it right. Plus also, I mean, I was judging whether or not whether or not I thought, you know decks would be better or wisdom with the you know which their saves might be better you know you can tell sometimes you sometimes you can't tell i mean ernest. zombies it was either it was fun you know ernest what'd you think uh i thought it was <laughs> a lot of fun uh thank you for giving me the opportunities to fuck with uh scott as much as possible that was great. um <laughs> that, that was their it was fun. sucked yeah Th thanks for being a tall person at least i needed someone <laughs> to pick on uh I appreciate that. He's the shaft. Uh, yeah. Rob, first time at the table, what'd you think? Um, well, first of all, I have to put out much gratitude because this has broken my <clears throat> two decade plus DM forever streak and two years plus without a game at all. So uh, oh. thank you all. It was an absolute pleasure. I had a lot of fun. Um, I like to kill things. I think I made an effective ranger. Absolutely. You did. Yeah. Rangers are not rangers are not useless, man. They don't no, suck I never, and I never thought they were, but everybody says they free they're no, useless. No. No. I think I might keep uh this character around and see where he goes. Well, we got I, more run shots uh, slated, so I think what it is is that rangers aren't as easy to min max as other characters. I, I'm not much be. of a min maxer, so that's kinda... that's you know, it's kind of obvious if you're gonna be a paladin or a fighter, you know, for you to take, you know, sentinel and great weapons <laughs> master and such as this. Yeah. And you, I mean you I thought kind of, <laughs> kind of know how to do that, but with Rangers, it's so harder plus to make six max. at first level is is about as maxed yeah. as you get. Yep. Yep. No, that was that's it was true. it was good. And it's better once yeah. you get to third when you actually pick it, yep. you know. Yeah, when you're used to it. Thing, man. Used kind of fanboying on that Tasha's cauldron of everything, uh primal yeah. companion <laughs> ranger. Oh boy. <laughs> that's nice. Well, maybe we'll see that next. With uh, this absolutely. ranger, man, I could summon mounts for myself. Yeah, you'll be on a mountain <laughs> next time though, so I'll screw you over. Folks, this has been Murder Hobo Inc. the one goat. shot edition. Mountain goats. Thanks for joining us. Follow us on Twitch, follow us on Twitter, take a look at our YouTube archive. You want to shoot the shit with us? Join our Discord. You want to buy our crap? Go ahead. Most importantly, if you want to have a seat like Rob did tonight on the game or the talk show on Tuesdays, M Hobo Inc. Twitter, Gmail. We will get you on there. Thanks, Pirate Dog Dice. Thank you, Oddfish Games. Thank you for watching. Uh, we will see you uh, tomorrow. The Franks uh, yeah. are in Halfling World. Uh, and I've got something a little special cooked up for them. Uh, for all of us here at Murder <laughs> Hobo Inc., thank you very much for joining us. Uh, don't forget to follow us. Everybody give the big dating game kiss and wave. Let's get the hell out of Dodge. Mwah.